a reading of the New Testament as rendered by the Gullah people. And as usual, we go to a, any spot. Uh, let's go here someplace. Uh, this, this three. Uh, we'll go to uh, 15 on page uh, two, I'm sorry, two, uh, 743, uh, this three, uh, 15. All the people, yeah, they say, hey, tell ya, and tell all the Christians for them, hey, God bless all of honor. And the uh, the translation, the translation is written uh, in, uh, you know, on the sides there. The gullah is right in the middle of the bigger font there. I have to put glasses on to read the smaller font right there. And the smaller font is actually the King James Version of the Holy Bible, the New Testament, of course. That's that uh, Shakespeare, uh, Christopher Marlowe language. Here's the interpretation. All that are with me, salute thee. Greet them that love us in the faith. Grace be with you all. Amen. And we usually do this twice. So this is the second reading. Uh, first the Gullah, and then we have the, uh, well, the Gullah's interpretation of the, of the, of the uh, New Testament. Uh, because it was, oh, the reason why I do this is because uh, when the, the Gullah people, my people, was on my mother's side, and um, I always wondered how they could be literate, you know, learn to read and write so quickly after they were freed. And uh, this just gives me some sort of context, I, I believe, somehow, was some sort of lineage connection. So here we go, second reading. All the people, yeah, they say, hey, to ya, and tell all we Christian for them, hey. God bless all of honor. And the interpretation, all that are with me, salute thee, greet them that love us in the faith. Grace be with you all. That's a reading. Of the New Testament as rendered by the Gullah people. My peoples. My being me. T from the Patterson's taking the train to Tibet, letting you know where I only suspect.